Happy Thursday. Eight technically is love, right? Love, which is desire, a deep feeling, uh, a pleasing. Love is thrown around very casually uh, in the Western society. Um, I know I've had to redefine kind of love rather than a love of possession, but a love of just energy, giving, unconditional love, which is immensely different than, you know, I love with, you know, a, a sexual love. Um, so to get deeper, I think the word compassion opens up or goes to more of the core of what the principle of love, in my mind, uh, accentuates or rings more true. The definition of compassion is uh, a concern for the feeling of others, a deep concern for uh, the feeling of others, sympathy. To be able to look at other people and have compassion, to be able to walk or to imagine to walk in their shoes. Um, is a great perspective. It takes me out of self. You know, I begin to look at the world rather than look uh, solely at myself um, or to begin to shine the same compassion that I've had on myself and the suffering that I've had to see that same compassion shine that onto other people. Because if I've been honest with myself, uncovered and discovered and discarded who and what I stand for and who and what I serve, um, you know, who I am, what I am, how I serve, and I, and I have the hope to be able to change what maybe I've been or who I've been because my actions, I, my actions make up my character. I have the faith to, that I, that I, can depend upon my community, the energy around me, higher power. Uh, I have the courage to begin to look at those truths about myself, whether I love all of them or don't like all of them, want to th you know, change myself a little bit, make adjustments, the integrity to do that, the willingness to think of something different, be open to change, open mind, open heart, open eyes. Um, and then the humility to take that direction as well. Humility to do something different. The humility to be right-sized, to see that those that are around me deserve the same compassion I grant myself. And this brings in that idea of like, well, what do you truly feel about yourself? How do you truly value yourself? And if you really, truly, deep down, hate yourself, then there's maybe an argument that at the end of the day, you may begin to be rude and mean to other people. So it's essential to, you know, roll back to the first part of that. It's like, well, how and how do I feel about me? I spend the most time with me. How can I shift how I feel about me? Because that will shift how I see and feel about the world. Am I grateful for my life? Am I compassionate to myself? Do I love myself? I think that, and then that's a, it's an uncovering of that. It's a very challenging, courageous thing to know the truth of oneself. Um, but it's worth the journey. Much love.